similar to Jeffrey, I have my own challenges with my disability, and uh, I felt like there's a, a need, you know, for uh, more people to be working on technologies and rehabilitation engineering, exoskeletons being one of them, wheelchair uh, designs, and other kind of adaptive equipment. So that's that's kind of how I got into ha wanting to do rehabilitative engineering. The whole story really started 18 years ago when Jeffrey got sick. And he's worked every day for 18 years to get better. As his caregiver and his mother, how could I do anything but help him every day? And so last summer we were talking about it and I had made a variety of projects myself, but this was gonna be a little bit more than what I could do in the garage between Ace Hardware and hire a welder. And I called the engineering department and they said, you know what, why don't you see if you can sign up to do a project? We put out a letter, email and stuff to friends and they just all came together. The $10,000 was way surpassed for the fee to get into the, to this program. This project has so much heart. In engineering, you know, this is really improving the life of a human being. And that's, as a biomedical engineer, that's kind of our goal too, you know, just using uh, engineering principles, mathematical principles, science principles, in order to improve human health. And I really feel like that's what we're doing with this project. The ultimate goal is to burn with the exoskeleton in the, the team has made it's been a really long exciting and beneficial journey for everyone involved. Here, no. If you grab his foot.